Hello and welcome to my Rage Fire Charm guide. This is pretty simple because you just basically follow where the fuck I go. <laughs> um, the only recommendations I have here or a thing that I can give you is that you should have like 30 to 50k HP since these bosses sometimes can hit like 25k crit and rage which equals to 50k uh, damage. Other than that, if you want to farm fast angel coins here, if you do five runs and opening the chests on top of it and kill every single mo monster in here, you get like two and a half thousand angel coins in five runs, which is uh, pretty good for dungeons. Other than that, you basically just follow the path that I'm walking here. Um, the dungeon is not too confusing, um, but I just make this pretty simple because I don't give a shit about the enemies in total, uh, in general. And i also not opening these little boxes which could contain angel coin boxes. So I basically just run from monster to monster to monster of the boss. And these bosses are dropping the angel enchanters. With the angel enchanters you can later on upgrade your um, accessories from plus 20 to plus 30. Um, so yeah, that's the only reason why you basically run this dungeon. Every boss drops up to two, as far as I know, and um, yeah, you basically just follow everything and... But make sure at this spot that is coming up right now that you always try to jump over these um, platforms. Otherwise there is a chance that you fall down and be stuck. Uh, in the ground because you can't come up again. If that happens, just teleport out or just try to s uh, sneak yourself out of there somewhat. Um, otherwise, yeah, as I said, just go out of the dungeon and you have no chance to complete it anymore. Yeah, you basically just um, run from monster to monster or to giant to giant. There are six giants in here that you have to kill to clear the dungeon. And yeah, this dungeon is pretty, pretty straightforward. It's really tough to like get lost there. Especially if you kill everything, then you will see what enemy or which path you've already been going to. Since uh, there will be no m en enemies anymore, so that's that. So the only special thing here is um, if you would be stuck on under a platform where these boss is standing on, just jump so that you are unstuck again. You see that that the monster is sometimes stuck in the bottom of the these um, platforms here, and um, just make sure to jump. And you see that my CS pad and stuff. Uh, also like uh, stuck in the ground whatever don't think too much about it just wait a moment until the boss is dead and he will pick it up so you're good to go if he's not picking it up just respawn your pet it's it's simple as that and yeah we're going to the last boss in the dungeon where we're going to turn left here and but then we gonna face the last single boss and after you killed the boss then the dungeon is cleared and that's all you have to do so as I said this is pretty straightforward and I hope you enjoyed this guide and you can complete it now